I felt like I was made to play football. Trying to play it to Smith! That's the record-breaking goal! I think at the end of the day, I've really been proud of what I've accomplished. 117 caps, uh, 46 goals. And a good ball to Kelly Smith, good control. This is a chance! And it's a goal! And a crucial goal, potentially, for England's World Cup ambitions. It's fantastic that people put you in that bracket as one of the best players in the world. It really is quite special to play for England. It's the ultimate for me, always has been from the age of 16 when I got my first cap. But I definitely will miss in that England shirt on and, and representing my country. The famous gifted boot of Kelly Smith has done the business. It was a massive part of my life for over 20 years I was on the national team, so it's, it's going to take time for me to fully pull away, but I think uh, the, definitely the time was right for me to step away. I think really what did it for me uh, emotionally was um, it was up at St George's Park and on the first day of training I just twisted a little bit awkwardly and felt a pain in my knee. You know, and I thought I'd done the ACL and I just thought right there and then that my heart was as low as it could be, my boots, and I just thought I, don't, I can't do this anymore. I can't physically put myself through it. Um, but lucky enough, my ACL was intact, but just that disappointment of missing that big Wembley game really um, hurt. And at the age of 36, I just felt um, I didn't have it in me anymore. And um, there's a lot of youngsters in the team that are really hungry um, to be playing, and I just felt that I'd lost that little bit of hunger and I felt well, if I'm, I've lost that, as much as I love playing for England, I felt like the battle to get back was probably too hard for me and um, decided to call it a day. <laughs> so many things I'm going to miss about playing for England. Obviously, it's unreal to play for your country, it really is, and I'm going to miss it, but I think at the end of the day, I've really been proud of what I've accomplished, 117 caps, uh, 46 goals. Um, I hold great pride in that, but I definitely will miss in that England shirt on and, and representing my country. I've got so many career highlights to, to list, memories that I have. All the players dreamed of playing um, in the World Cup and in China, and it was, you know, um, a major tournament for the first major, major tournament for everybody involved. And uh, to score two goals in that was really, really special. During that night before Japan, um, I just thought if I, if I score a, a good goal, I'm going to take my boot off and kiss it. No one's ever done that before. But then I just put it to bed. So when that moment happened, uh, when I was in a really good position, Kaz Kani played me the ball through. And I kind of put it through my legs at the top of the box and turned and, and shot. And it went in. It was just like, wow, this is the moment. And I just, that was it boot was off and kissed it. And then the second goal, that was unexplainable too because both boots come off. So it was just, uh, nothing that bit wasn't planned, but it was just a really nice moment. Kelly Smith, it's back to Williams. Trying to play it to Smith. That's the record breaking goal. Nobody has scored more goals for their country than Kelly Smith. For me, it was never really a goal of mine to do that. It just wanted to go out and play and win and score goals and help the team win. Um, but when I was getting closer to it, um, obviously when I broke it, it was a real special moment, but it was never like something that I'd you know, written down on a piece of paper to say, I've got to beat this because I don't, I don't work like that. Um, but to score as many goals as that, um, it's really special for me. It's amazing to, to have been uh, recognised as FIFA World Player of the Year, even though I finished third. Um, but just to to be alongside those players, Marta Wombat, um, Christian, Brazil. It's fantastic that people put you in that bracket of, of players and that they regard you so highly as one of the best players in the world. It's, it's special because you know you can't get any higher than that really can you as one of the best players in the world unless you win it like Marta. <laughs> the future's bright for England because the game is in such a good good place. Um, the England team's really doing well, the attention's on the England team. The young coach and Mark Sampson on board. 
Kitchen's brought a lot of new, fresh ideas to the table, brought a lot of new young faces in. Um, so the, the Dasha team now is just going to skyrocket if they do well at, the, at this tournament, which I hopefully think that they will.